Hey everyone, Nick Berlin with Berlin Builds. Today I want to talk to you about this air compressor that comes with two nail guns and a stapler. Last time I was at Home Depot I saw that this was on sale for $199, which is a killer deal. I picked this up for $199 five years ago. So I've had this for a long time. Normally the price is $299, which even at the price of $299 you're getting a really good deal. But if you can get it on sale for $199, you're you're walking away with an awesome package. I have used this package deal a ton. I've used this to trim out my house. I've used it to frame. I've also used it to make furniture. I've used it to pump up the air in my tires. Like this thing is, <laughs> I mean, it's fantastic. And for the price point, it's hard to beat. Now with this, um, it's a little bit louder of a unit than I would care for, but for the price point, it's, I mean, I'm gonna just put in my earplugs and everything's gonna be fine. It's really easy to use. I mean, you have an on and off switch, and then you've got your two different gauges. One that tells you how much pressure is actually in the unit, and then your regulated pressure, which is what the pressure is when it's coming to your tool. And then you've got your knob for adjusting the regulated pressure. You've got two different hose ports, so you can be running two different tools at the same time. Um, you have a relief valve that's right here, and then you have like your big relief valve, which is actually back here in the back. It's a little brass knob. This is really easy to use. Um, every now and then, what will happen is I've noticed that the internal connections inside are a little weak. So if I throw this, like literally throw this into my truck, sometimes it won't turn on. And what I have to do is I have to take apart the housing and I just have to check the connection of those wires. I actually have another video on Facebook. I'll put a link in the description below on how to do that fix. Um, but if you're nice to your air compressor, you won't have to deal with that. I've actually recommended this to my family and friends. I have, well actually my dad has this same air compressor and I'm pretty sure my, my sister-in-law has the same air compressor with the nail guns that came with it. Now, talking about the air guns, this is the 16 gauge nailer. I've shot thousands of nails through this. And it's not, it's not the greatest nailer, but it is a good nailer. You can get a lot done with this, um, especially if you're just getting into finished carpentry or you've got some DIY projects around the house. I really like having these nailers. Some of the issues that I have with them is every now and then you'll get it, so it'll shoot a nail and it'll, like, it'll double shoot. And you have to just go out and you have to get your pliers and, and pull out the extra nail, which is kind of frustrating. They can also jam sometimes, which is actually really easy to fix. You've got these two little springs right here, and all you do is you, you just push on those, and then you've got this little flap, and you can normally just pull the nail out. So, not that big of a deal. So I didn't know that you are supposed to oil these things until about a year ago, and I've had this for about five years. So I ran this thing with no oil for about four years, and I eventually killed one of these. This is my second one of these nail guns. I killed, <laughs> I killed my first one after four years of, of moderate use. And for getting a nail gun for four years at this price point, it's, I really can't complain. Now, I do recommend that you oil your tools that will make them last longer. Um, this little 18 gauge Brad nailer, I love this thing. I've done a ton with this. I really can't complain about this one. This is still the original one that I got five years ago and only started oiling about a year ago. And this thing has been through the war and back and it's got some crazy stories and I really like it. Now, when it comes to the stapler, I have never actually, <laughs> I have never shot a staple through this thing. It's just not something that I use. So it's just kinda, at my old house, it just sat on the wall next to the other ones, just ready to go. I can't tell you if the stapler is any good. I don't know, I never really use it. I am going to assume that it's pretty decent because the nail guns are pretty decent. But honestly, from first hand experience, I can't say anything. So if you're looking to get some nail guns and an air compressor to do some carpentry stuff around your house, some other random DIY stuff, and some other little things that you see on Pinterest, this is a great purchase for you to make. Honestly, this is a great purchase. For $199, you're getting an air compressor, like I said, you're getting an air hose, two guns, and a stapler. That is a really cheap setup for something that works really well. I mean, it's got 
some flaws. I mean, it's not the most expensive nail gun out in the market. It's not gonna shoot flawlessly. It doesn't have the little button that you push that shoots air to clear dust off of the workpiece. It doesn't have that. This is a little bit bare bones, but it works. I've done all the basin case in my house with this. I hung doors with this 16 gauge nailer. I've done so many things. <laughs> I don't even know exactly how many nails I've shot from these, probably in the 10, thousand plus range. If Home Depot is really far away from you or you just don't feel like driving there, um, I've got a link in the description below. You can go there and you can purchase this kit. It might not be the $199 sale price depending on when you're watching this video. It might be back up to $299. But this is a really good package. I highly recommend it and I hope that it treats you really good. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like button if you liked what you saw. And if you have any questions, throw them in the comments below. And if you like videos about tools and construction stuff and building cool little random furniture projects, hit subscribe. We post videos on a pretty regular basis. Thanks. Bye.